Hey, Fireheads. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and subscription. Once again, this is a collective reading. I was channeling um, the song by Jamie Foxx. Um, uh, I don't even know the name of it. It goes, so get comfortable. We about to do something we never done before. Maybe not the usual. Tonight we're getting unpredictable. So there's um, some type of unpredictability that is about to happen into your life. Something that you didn't predict happening. Or, or there's about to be some unpredictable chaos in someone else's life. It's about to be some unpredictable chaos in someone's life. Because they made a decision against you. They made a decision to do something against you. So, whoever it is, they definitely was doing stuff against you. Either paying for magic or trying to do it themselves. I hear kitchen magic. I hear that the most. Kitchen magic. And they about to be in the Ten of Swords. They wanted you in the Ten of Swords. No, they about to be in the Ten of Swords. They wanted you out here to be bitter, exhausted, feeling like everything you do is at a dead end. No, they wanted that tower for you. They wanted instabilities for you. They That's what they wanted for you. But guess what? It's going to happen to them. The tower is falling in their life right now. Disaster, destruction, disbelief, grief. Everything is happening to them right now as we speak. They wanted you to give up on your hopes, your dreams, your desires. They wanted you to give up on God. They wanted people to give up on you. They didn't want people around you. They didn't want people to celebrate you. They didn't want men to see you as desirable. They didn't want men to see you as an asset. They wanted men to see you as a liability. They didn't want people to see you as credible. They wanted people to see you as someone not trustworthy. They wanted you up at night wondering, hoping and wishing and praying that something happens, something gives in your life. Even though you've been doing the work. It's like, now this don't make sense. I've been doing the work, but there's I'm not getting shown anything. That's because there was somebody in the background trying to take everything that was coming in from you. And they thought they was taking it. But all it was doing was being stored in a separate account. It was being stored in an offshore account. That's what I just heard. It was being stored in an offshore account. And I know y'all know about those. How people here in the States, okay, okay, when they are hiding money or hiding anything they don't want anybody to know about or anybody to take away from them, they transfer all of their goods all of their funds all of their collectibles whatever you want to call it to an offshore account so it cannot be touched by anyone within the states that's how this that's how this spell worker this evil ass bitch and that's what i'm gonna call her and if you don't like what i'm saying you can click off because i'm so sick of this goddamn energy i'm sick of people thinking they can play god in your life and sometimes I do ask God, well, they ain't gone, God. You let them go this far. And then God got to slap my ass back in check to let me know it was all to teach you. But when they, when I told them to stop, they didn't. It was all to teach you. You know, people sign contracts to come here and be evil towards you. People sign contracts to be jealous towards you. Now, there are some people that they don't even know. There are some people who you don't even know. That are just out here doing evil shit. Speaking evil shit against you. Wishing, praying that evil shit happens to you. And then you have others who were assigned to your purpose. Those who were actually here assigned to do the evil shit to you. I, I, I'm just I'm just gonna break it down how it is, okay? But in that in that assignment, it says where they were supposed to stop once you reach that level of understanding. And if they don't, this is what was gonna happen. 
And that is what's happening now. To those alike and not alike. Okay? Those who you know and don't know. Who have spoken against your stability. Spoken against your ten of cups in life. Spoken against your health. Shit. Spoken against your hair. Just speak against shit. Just because. It's just something bitter and deep. Rooted darkness with inside of them. We got the uh, King of Pentacles and the ten, uh, ten of Pentacles, but but it don't matter because one thing you cannot do. This ain't no Kevin Gates song. You can't go to war with God. What, what, what you? Who you think? The fuck you is. You hear me? I'm trying not to be so profane, but who do you think you are, thinking that you could go to war with God? This ain't no rap song. Whoever this person is, they still gonna come out on top. They still gonna have the love, the legacy. You hear me? The the influence, the privilege, the security, the safety, the abundance. They still gonna have all of that. All because this person or these people think that they stopping this star. They're not stopping this star. They not. They can't your faith too strong. You have the power to heal yourself. So therefore you know you can heal others. You allow God to pour his wisdom, his knowledge and understanding into you through the Holy Spirit. Man, somebody about to win the lottery. Somebody about to win the lottery. And I'm going to claim this for me too. I'm claiming this reading for myself just as well. Somebody's going to win the lottery because I just heard, oh, you know, um, do y'all remember back, y'all, I don't know if you still got it on your cash out. Remember when cash out, uh, when it, it used to those coins, you hear them coins when money deposited. I don't is that still like that? Because I don't even got the notification on, I don't think. But um but I but I seen like jackpot or something. You know, I seen jackpot in my mind's eye and I heard that sound. So yeah, somebody gonna somebody about to win the lottery, baby. Hold on, y'all. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, somebody about to win the lottery. Y'all hear me? Somebody about to win the lottery, and I claim this for myself. But yeah, somebody thought that they was going to go to war uh, with God against your path. Go to war with God about you. That don't even make sense. Like, this how you know this person's mind is warped. And whoever this person is or these people are, they are experiencing some great detrimental, I'm hearing, towers in their life at the moment. They sure are. They are experiencing some great towers in their life. You hear me? And they want to project it onto you because they can't even, I'm telling y'all, they can't even handle this shit coming their way. So continue to stay prayed up. Continue to speak life into your situations. Speak money into your situations. Speak love into your situations. Speak clarity and send that shit back. All you got to do is speak. You hear me? If you feel like there's other practices you need to do, if you are led to do them, please be open to it. But as for me and mine, I'm going to speak because the, my mouth is the highest vibration. 
and I'm going to speak everything what thus said God is to me and what I am supposed to have and who I am, especially if I am doing the work, especially if I am abiding to the law. Whoever this is, they thought they was going to stop this star. I am not lying. They thought they was going to stop you from having your wish come true in life. Stop you from having success, satisfaction, achievements, recognition, pleasure. They thought they was going to stop that. They just did not know how strong your goddamn faith was. They did not know how stable with this ten of pentacles and the star energy. They did not know how stable. They did not know how strong your, your faith was. They didn't know that you can command the wind. They didn't know that. They didn't know that you had hope. You hear me? They didn't know that the inspiration that was within you was something that was undeniable. It was real. It's real. It's positive. It's real. See, they thought you was faking. This ain't no joke. This ain't no game. Um, we're not looking for Carmen San Diego. You hear me? Wanted you heartbroken. Wanted you just all over the place. This is what they wanted. That's what she wanted. That's what he wanted. That's what they wanted. But it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. You're about to receive abundance on top of abundance. You're about to have a legacy. You're about to have that family. You're about to be stable. You're about to have this untraditional life, even though the Ten of Pentacles is about tradition. But you, the life you're about to live is unorthodox because nobody knows of it. Nobody knows of the life God is about to give to you. We expect these blessings to be... Oh, I'm, I'm popping on social media or oh, I got a bend or whatever. It's, child, it's something greater. It's something greater. Eyes have not seen. Ears have not heard. Nor has it entered into the heart of a man what God is about to do for you. He about to take you on a merry-go-round. Merry-go-round. <laughs> it's like it's, it's just not going to stop. It's just going to keep coming. It's just going to keep coming around to you. These blessings going to keep coming around to you. Lord. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten M's in my bank account. In my bank account. In my bank account. <laughs> I'm telling you. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah. They thought you was going to be without. They thought you were going to be an old lady. You hear me? Wishing and still hoping. Waiting on God to give you. The fruits of your labor. God said, no, baby, you about to get that now. And they about to sit back and while they are in toil and labor, they about to sit back and watch you enjoy the fruits of your labor. Your spiritual labor. We're not talking about nothing here on the natural, baby. Your spiritual labor is not to be fucked with. Okay? It's not to be fucked with. Empress.
Yeah, yeah. I wanted you all out in the cold. Wanted you. Ooh, chat. These folks make your head hurt. I ain't lying. I mean, it's coming in. You hear me? This, the Empress, the Chariot. Can I? Let me see what's on top. The Three of Wands. The Seven of Coins. The World. Girl, you. But And the Star's out here twice. I'm just here to tell you. I'm just here to tell you. That your spiritual, your spiritual, you hear me, growth is just not to be fucked with. I, I, I'm telling you. And the angels, God, the council of heaven, everybody sees this. They see your, your growth. They see your growth. Girl, the stars out here twice. They see your growth, baby. It, is, it, it is, can't be denied. Okay? And you are definitely about to receive everything you desired from heaven to earth. And this is my message.